Okay, so it has been a long time since we've had any news about a new Mario Kart, but something has emerged. So IGN has published a brand new article, and it's about Mario Kart 9, and the two things that it confirms is that, number one, Mario Kart 9 is currently in active development, and also it will have a new racing twist, and could be teased later this year. So. If you really think about it, nothing here has really been said. Because I'd like to think that Mario Kart 9 has been in development for a while now. And it was pretty obvious that it would have like a brand new twist or gimmick. Because every Mario Kart has to have a new twist or gimmick. That, that's how they market it. But yeah, at least we now know like Mario Kart 9 is definitely a thing. But yeah, with that being said, I'm predicting that the trailer for this Mario Kart 9 will come out sometime in the mid-year. If you guys didn't actually know, in I think August is Mario Kart's 30th anniversary. So from August 2022 to August 2023 is like the range of the anniversary. So I'm predicting we're going to get the trailer for this Mario Kart game on uh, August. And then the game will maybe have a release date on Christmas, if not Christmas, if that's too early, then early 2023, I guess. But yeah, that's what I think will happen. Game is definitely confirmed now, which is great. It has been so long since we've had like a brand new mainline Mario Kart. If you're not counting Mario Kart Tour or Mario Kart Live, which don't really count in my eyes, it has been a long time, mate. And Mario Kart 8 Deluxe as well, it's not exactly like a brand new title, because it's just Mario Kart 8 ported on the Switch, but yeah, so this has got a lot of people talking on like the potential names and what the gimmick will be in the game. So in terms of the names, people are thinking it's going to be called Mario Kart 10, because apparently Mario Kart Tour counts as an iteration of the game, so like Mario Kart Tour is technically Mario Kart 9, and this new Mario Kart can be like Mario Kart 10. I don't know about that bro. But um, another potential name is Mario Kart X, which sounds sick. Um, and then another name is Nintendo Kart. If they bring like lots of characters from different Nintendo franchises and like different tracks, kind of like what they've done a little bit in Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, um, Nintendo Kart would be such a cool name. Now in terms of this brand new gimmick, lots of people have been talking about potential ideas of this gimmick one of them being them bringing back the double dash gimmick which was like the two players on one cart i think it would be really cool for them to bring it back but not as like the main gimmick of the game uh, i wouldn't want to do that in like all of the racing you know online and grand prix i think that it should just be a little vs mode thing like an option that you can change in verse mode. I think that would be a, a cool thing to play around with. But like that was kind of Mario Kart Double Dash's gimmick. We want like a brand new one, you know? If you think about it, a gimmick is like the main thing that they can use to market the game. So the gimmick doesn't have to be something gameplay wise. It could be something mode wise. I was thinking, and lots of people have been thinking this as well. What if there was some sort of story adventure mode? I think that would be the sickest thing and that could definitely be something that they can use to market the game with. I think that would get everyone excited when they see that. And like in this adventure mode, I don't know, you visit new places and like that's how you unlock characters and uh, vehicle parts and like you do races and it just gets harder. There could be boss battles. It has so much potential and like Nintendo can think of some really cool ideas for it. It could just be insane man. Another thing they can bring back is the mission mode. They can also use that to market the game. I'm sure everyone will want the mission mode to come back. They All they're going to do is just literally they could copy the Mario Kart DS mission mode. I don't know, just change up the missions a bit, make them a bit harder. Uh, do some new boss battles as well. That could be really fun. Now something else that I think they should do which would be amazing is they should make the coins more valuable. And they should do this by introducing like some sort of shop where you can spend the coins you get on the racetrack. And you could buy things like characters, 
vehicle parts, uh, like yeah, the gliders, wheels, stuff like that. And they can make it like a weekly shop. So every week there's brand new uh, things in the shop. I feel like that would make players wanna, you know, play every week. Cause I have Mario Kart 8 Deluxe right now. I've pretty much completed the game. I've got three stars on all the cups, beat all the staff ghosts, and uh, I played online, but I don't really play it too much anymore because it's not that fun. So I really have no reason to play the game. So I really have no reason to go back to the game right now. But if they have some sort of shop that changes every week, that will get me at least playing once a week. So I think that would be a great move for them. And also, uh, with the shop idea, that can make it so that there's no limit of like characters and vehicle parts. They could just introduce as many as they want, whenever they want. And oh, that would just be so sick, man. Just like jumping in the shop and seeing what character is new. And with the tracks, I imagine they're sort of running out of ideas because there's only so many themes you can have of, for like the tracks. But what I would love to see is tracks based on like areas in different games. So if you look at just the Mario and Luigi and Paper Mario games, there are already so many places where the tracks can be based off of and it would just be awesome seeing tracks like that. So yeah, in summary, Mario Kart trailer hopefully dropping sometime in the next six to eight months. I don't know, we'll see. And um, there are just so many ideas. This better be a good Mario Kart dude. Like, I hope they don't focus too much on what the game looks like because the game already looks amazing with like the details and the tracks and just the quality and the character models as well. Like they all look amazing. They don't need to be improved. I feel like they're as good as they're gonna get for now. I hope they focus more on like the modes um, and the gameplay, the shop ideas talking about. And yeah, I'm excited for this man, but still gonna be a bit of a wait. But yeah, that's all I wanted to talk about.